Gentleman from Texas is recognized. Mr. Speaker, I rise in support of the Hack Your State Department Act, which will help address lingering cybersecurity gaps at the Department of State. The massive breach of the State Department's unclassified computer network in 2014 exposed grave weaknesses. In the years since th that attack, problems have continued to mount. The Department's Cybersecurity Response Program received a D rating, the lowest of any agency on its Federal Information Security Management Act report card in 2017. Last September, the department revealed that it recently suffered a breach of its unclassified email system, which exposed the personal information of some of its employees. The department needs cost-effective solutions to these IT security challenges. Today's legislation directs the Secretary of State to develop and implement a vulnerability disclosure uh, process that will allow threat researchers from the private sector to identify and report cybersecurity flaws. Currently, there is no legal avenue that allows them to do so. This bill fixes that problem. The bill will establish a bug bounty pilot program to reward ethical hack hackers for discovering and reporting vulnerabilities at the department. These programs have been used successfully by the Defense Department and numerous private companies to improve their cyber defenses at minimal cost. In fact, I remember introducing a similar bill for the Department of Homeland Security. As a national security agency, the State Department must do more to secure its networks. The Hack Your State Department Act is a small but important step towards cost-effective solutions. I want to thank the author, Mr. Liu, uh, for putting his computer science background to work uh, here in the Congress. And he understands, I believe, the nature of the threats that we face in the cyber realm and the importance of a strong cyber security partnership between the public and private sectors. I urge support and I reserve the balance of my time. Gentleman from Texas, reserve.